What did Dawkins believe about the origin of life? Well, Dawkins believes that it's certainly not created by God. I mean, he's, he, he starts there. He's very committed to this idea that God is an absurdity. But he listen to what he says, because he admits that his own belief is incredibly absurd and unlikely. He says, nobody knows how it happened, but somehow, without violating the laws of physics and chemistry, which they just emerged from nowhere, a molecule arose that just happened to have the property of self-copying. What does he mean by that? Well, it'd be great if life just emerged, but it can't just emerge it has to be able to sustain itself, otherwise life goes away and you're back to square one. So it has the property of self-copying, a replicator, and he says this may seem like a big stroke of luck. Freakish or not, this kind of luck does happen, he says. So the sort of lucky event that we're looking at could be so wildly improbable that the chances of it happening somewhere in the universe could be as low as one in a billion, billion, billion in any one year. So he's saying one over uh, as a one with 27 zeros. He's like, yeah, I'm a, I would put all of my eggs in that basket. And by the way, that's just the likelihood of, of a life having a self-replicator, not the earth having all the sustainable conditions for life and life emerging in the first place. So it's so improbable that it's absurd.